hi my angels so i'm back and i have a wig that i want to share with you so um this wig is by rpg hair i'm not sure if you're familiar with them i think i've done a review in the past um that was like a natural um kinky straight or something like that but anyways i went back and i got this unit it's going for 79 dollars, and if you pay five dollars more you get an extra um removable elastic band which i'll show you um, it is their pre-plucked um, 4.5 inches parting lace front wig. It's naturally curly with 180% um, density and it's a bob. So the actual item number is um, BOB01 if you get on the website. And like I said, I'll link everything down below. So let me give you a little bit about the hair before I take it out. So the hair type says 100% Indian Remy. It is curly as far as the texture. The length is eight inches. The color of the hair is natural black. The cap size is medium. The lace is brown. It is a, um, the cap construction is a lace front wig. And it says the knots are already bleached. So we will see um, once I take it out. So this is their box. And it has their logo on the um, outside. Um, let me remove the hair and I'll see what's inside. Cause they like to send little goodies. So, this is the actual um, elastic that I paid $5 extra for. You get a wig cap. And this is the actual, um, no, actually, let me do that over. So they send you a wig cap. <laughs> they send you the um, detachable um, elastic and then you get extra elastic. So let me say that right. And um, they also send a rat tail comb and inside you get their pamphlet which tells you about their company it pretty much um tells you what um social media you can follow them on and then um, a little bit about the hair and how to take care of it and all the information you need so this is the actual hair and um it tells you on the outside the item number the actual um length of the hair the density and the color and the cap size and all that so everything's on that little sticker so let me go ahead and remove this and i will actually show you what it looks like Okay, queen, so it is a actual really thick unit. So it is actually, it looks about the 180 density. Um, the front of the unit, you can see um, it does look pre-plucked, but I know some people like to go in and do touch-ups. Let's look on the underside. So this is the actual parting space. So you get the 4.5 inches worth of parting. Um, you get one comb on the side, one on the other side, you get one in the top. And then in the very back, you get one wide comb and your adjustable straps. So, so ladies, this is the actual um, elastic um, strap that you get. And the other one is just an extra piece, but you can always adjust this to whatever um, length you want it. And then this little part right here, it goes inside the wig. So you're supposed to like push it in the little slot here and then you do the other end on the other side of the wig. So um, what I'm going to do, um, it does say it's um, bleached as far as the knots, but I'm going to go ahead and add uh, powder and then I'll do a little hairspray and let it sit there for like a minute. And then I'll remove the lace and try this wig on so you can see it. Don't you go anywhere. I'll be right back. All right, ladies, so I didn't want to cheat. I wanted to try this on before I added the powder so you can see what it looks like. So this is the actual um, hairline up close. Let me just, okay. So this is the actual hairline. And there's a lot of room underneath this wig and um, I haven't um, put the elastic in. I don't think I'll need it because it comes, um, with the comb in the back and then I have the extra combs on the side and all that. Um, so let me go ahead and part this and then I will show you what this looks like before I add my powder underneath. So that's the middle part. And just in case you ladies want to do a side part. So it doesn't look too bad, but I'm still going to add the powder underneath and then um, I'm going to cut this lace off. 
so you ladies can actually my parting skills are always off yeah so you can see what it looks like um with the actual I look like a wild um, beast. <laughs> this is a 360 on the wig. So this is the actual right side. This is the wig in the back. So it's, it's really cute. I like the length because I can actually go to work and wear this because I wear a mask all day. So let me go ahead and take this off and then I will add the powder underneath. Like I said, I'll come back and show you everything. All right. So this is what I'm going to be using. Then I'll add a little hairspray and then I will let it sit for about a minute and then I will remove the lace and try the unit on. Ladies, before you put your wigs on, always shake the wigs out if you haven't co-washed the hair, which I did before I put this wig on. So don't think I just put it on my head without shaking it. And um, I actually went ahead and removed the actual lace and this is the actual hairline. So you're definitely going to have to use a little bit of um, got to be glued or any other glue that you have just in these areas because it really fits really snug once you actually, you know, put some security in the back. And as far as I'm um, shedding, I'm getting just a couple strands, but that could be because the unit is brand new. Um, so, yeah, let me go ahead and just give you another 360 and I'll show you the parting area. So this is the back. This unit is so thick. It's just a lot of hair. And then I'm going to actually wet this unit because you can actually wear it wet. And if I left anything out, just leave me a comment down below or my email address is always in my description box. Um, if you want to reach out to me via email. Now underneath, I did do the powder method with the actual um, hairspray. So let's see what that looks like now. So that looks much better, doesn't it? And you could still add a little powder on the outside. Let's part her in the middle. So it does look very realistic right now. And like I said, if you want to do your um, plucking a little bit better, um, if you don't like it the way it is, you can always do that. You know, your wigs are yours. You do according. So, yeah, this is the unit. So, let me go ahead and um, add some water to it and try to give it a little bit of life. Because <laughs> right now I look like the professor who invented the light bulb. <laughs> so, I created this um, Garnier and water mixture and it was in my daughter's bathroom. Don't ask me why, because I use this when I do my wig reviews. So yeah, let's go ahead and wet this hair. Actually, I'm gonna add a little bit of this in the hair and then I'll add some of the water mixture I created. So all I'm gonna do now to hide these little areas in the front, I'm just gonna add a little bit of powder. And I think I wanna do like a flip over side part type thing going on and then I'll show you the actual um, back as well. So let me just add some powder in this spot right here and I'll be back. All right my queen what do you think? This is like the cutest little wig ever. Like you could just throw this on, add a little water, and you're out the door. You know what I mean? It's not a lot of um, work. And um, what I did, I didn't glue it. All I did was just um, pull just a little bit of my hair out on the sides. And like I said, it's very secure on there because I put my um, elastic um, straps in the back all the way to the very end. Um, but yeah, let me know what you ladies think about this wig. Let me turn around and show you what it looks like in the back. This is so freaking adorable. And you can actually wear this wet or dry. 
So yeah, so this is the right side. This is the back of the wig. Not a lot of hair on your neck. This is cute, you know, for like summer. But yeah, so I did the side part method. Um, if you want to, you can always just move your um, parting to wherever you want it. And this will still look cute. A middle, you know what I mean? And add a little powder, which I might just do now since we're here. Let me just add a little powder. Okay, so this is just so super cute. This is for like somebody who doesn't want to spend all day in the uh, mirror, you know, styling their wigs and getting it ready. Not everybody have time for that. Um, this is good for someone who doesn't like a lot of hair on their neck. So this is super, super, super cute. Let me know what you ladies think about this one. I am actually loving this wig. But I think I prefer wearing mine just not this wet, but a little bit, you know, more on the dry side. So yeah, let me know what you ladies think. Um, once again, this hair is from RPG Hair. I will leave all the link down below for you where you can actually find this unit. And like I said, if you pay the $5 extra, you'll actually get the... Um, You'll get extra elastic, but they'll send this as well. And you can always, um, you know, get this trim a little bit more at an angle if you want, or just leave it. Just leave the wig. Leave the wig. <laughs> leave the wig. Yeah, let me know what you ladies think. So, yeah, this is the hair that I wanted to share with you today. So, yeah, let me know what you think. Leave me a comment. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video. Like and share this video, give me a thumbs up, and don't forget to turn on your notification. So I won't keep you ladies much longer. Um, so I'm just going to leave you on this note. Stay fabulous as you are. Do the right thing always. Keep a clean heart. Take care of each other. And please pay attention to your surroundings. I love you ladies. God bless you. One love. Mwah. <laughs>